Hello everyone, this is Nadine Dossier of EnergyWorksHealers.com. Excited to have you here with me today. We're going to be receiving uh, another powerful attunement from the angels and ascended masters. And we have been chosen by beloved Master El Moria to receive a protective, a shielding attunement today. Master El Moria is known for being connected to the blue flame of the will of God. It's the first ray in the seven rays. And if you're wanting to learn more about the rays of the sacred flames, I encourage you to read um, Aurelia Jones, her book titled The Seven Sacred Flames. I It is all online on PDF files, so I'm going to leave an attachment of that below for you to check out. So the focus right now with Master El Moria, he's giving us an extra layer of protection. It's really more woven. I want you to think of it being woven into your entire being. So it's not just an outer protective shield, but it's within and all around you. It becomes a part of you. And this is really necessary for us at this time. And I love the way that working with the masters and the angels just brings so much illumination to my field because I learned something from working with him. So before working with Master El Moria, I, I really understood that as we one of the most powerful things we can do for protection is healing ourselves, is clearing the layers of karmic debris, clearing the negative emotional mental patterns um, that connect to connect us to lower negative energies or entities so nothing that we don't vibrate at a similar level to at some essence of our being can attach to us so the more that we clear ourselves the less there is for the yuck to attach to us and I'll give a simple explanation of this if I have a lot of issues believing in my capabilities and my abilities. When someone comes to my door, or email, or Facebook, however you want people to connect with you, and says, you're no good. Now again, if I don't believe that I'm any good, it's going to stick with me. That energy is going to stay with me. It's going to build on top of the other um, energy that was already there that believed I was no good. Now, if I have cleared that layer and I believe, I realize that in essence I am a good person, I have many good abilities and skills to share with the world when somebody comes knocking at my door telling me that I'm no good, I will be able to rise above. I'm not going to say that it's not, you know, it's a pleasant experience, but I will rise above it. So that is how clearing and healing ourselves make us less susceptible to psychic attack. Now, here's um, a layer that Master El Moria showed me working with him. Okay, so yes, as we clear ourselves, there's less to attach to. At the same time, what is left over, what the karma, the baggage, the debris that we carry over is heightened. And it's heightened because all of our psychic senses are heightened as we clear ourselves. We all know we've that received attunements, that have you know received empowerments, that receive clearings, that do the spiritual work. You know that as you clear and cleanse yourself, you expose more of your beauty you're already psychic and you just expose more of these capabilities and as you expose more of these capabilities you become more sensitive on all levels so that which is painful is magnified um, and also that which is positive is also magnified and amplified so it goes we know that it goes for both ways so because we've done such rapid clearing and adjustments to ourselves um, 
And we are collectively becoming more and more psychically sensitive and sensitive to all things around us. We are needing an extra element of protection that is within and all around us that becomes part of us and stays with us as long as we need it to. This is what we're going to receive from beloved Master Al Moria today. And you can listen to this time and time again to solidify this energy, this new energy, or maybe to receive more than one different type of protective element. So I'd like to give, I've done a few different um, one-on-one uh, attunements with Master Almoria for the protective shield, and so I can tell you a little bit of what I've seen in people's energy fields, so you can kind of kind of guess what to expect. Um, with one woman, she's a very powerful um, medium, a, a psychic, a healer, and you know she was experiencing a lot of headaches and when I worked with her um, what the angels and masters had said was that she needed extra protection um, especially within the mental frame because she actually can read people's minds which is a very positive um, ability in her work but when she's just you know going through daily life and connecting to other people's worry thoughts or their negative mental patterns, um, it can be very harmful. So they wove into her energy field. It was actually looked to me like citrine crystal energy grid. And it really was woven in. Think about it being woven into the, the cells in the body, woven into the nervous system, in the nadis, and the meridians, and the chakra. It's just one with you. And that's what happened for her. Another woman that I worked with, um, what I saw for her was a blessing of holy water within and all around her. And the cool thing about the holy water was that um, she, the, not only was it protecting her and kind of creating this washing things off that don't serve her, um, it also served to bless all the energies that come into her life. So it's not just protective, but it's blessing, which I love. Um, another, which I, th I think the citrine shield did too, but I just love the way to see that with the holy water. And then there was another, um, yet another empowerment where I saw some sacred symbols. Another one where I saw the element of the central sun, and it was like this golden, fiery energy. Um, so whatever it is that you're receiving, it's going to be perfect for you. It's exactly what you need. Um, because this is the thing, you know, we kind of have gotten used to doing these cookie-cutter energy protection practices, and we really all are so unique. We all have our unique needs, and... Um, also unique areas of weakness so the the energy is going to be heightened you know I talk about it being woven in but it will be there may be extra shields um, uh, set in certain areas that have just been areas of weakness for you um, in, in regards to psychic attack which also might be uh, then transfer into you know weakness physically so um, just sense as you're receiving the attunement sense you know allow yourself to feel what's going on within your body you might see you might feel it you might hear something or you might just feel really relaxed and all of that is okay honor your experiences as they come to you that's part of receiving a deep attunement another thing I just want to offer while you're receiving the attunement is just to set um you can even place your hands on your heart and just let your focus be on gratitude for what you're receiving. What happens is your heart opens, your entire being opens to receiving on a deeper level. Um, so um, moving forward, I just how to connect with Master El Moria. I, I said... Um, I did mention um, Aurelia Jones' um, readings on him. There are many um, 
different um, invocations that she has and prayers um, to working with the the blue ray, the blue flame, and working with Master El Moria. Um, and I'd also just like to mention in her book, she also me mentions stones, crystals that you can use to connect. Um, lapis lazuli is one of them. A sapphire, the peacock ore, the peacock stones, and blue lace agate. Um, some essential oils that you might want to work with right now. Um, hyssop, that's H-Y-S-S-O-P. As said, um, purge me with hyssop and I shall be clean. Hyssop is a powerful um, cleanser and purification herb. And what it does, um, it cleanses us on all levels, physical, mental, emotional, spiritual. Um, but especially accented in this, or highlighted in the spiritual and physical. Um, so that is a wonderful, it's one of my favorite um, essential oils that I work with. And then another one, because there's so many for protection. Okay, there's so many. You'll look at and you might, you know, throw a stick at an essential oil and find one that says that it's protective. I'm going to just, um, to make it easy for everyone and work with one that's really of a high vibration is sandalwood. Sandalwood um, we've known for opening the higher chakras, so it, it's also known for protection. And a lot of us, one of the reasons why we're needing so much protection is because of all of the opening of the higher chakras. So sandal one is a great go-to um, essential oil for protection. But there's many, many, many different herbs. I just um, invite you to kind of study that a little bit. And my sister and I, just to let you know, we're going to be doing a class on protection that we'll have available locally and we'll have available online. So just keep, um, you know, keep your uh, connected to us on Facebook, here on YouTube, on um, email, and you'll you'll get notifications on that because we're going to have a lot of herbs listed on there as well. Um, okay, and working with El Moria myself, I did create a invocation to working with him and Archangel Michael. Again, they work together often to help cleanse and empower us. I do want to say one of the special blessings of working with a master um, an ascended master such as El Moria, is that they lived in the physical body. They lived on earth. They understand and know firsthand the limitations of living in this um, physical body and the material world. And they know how to ascend <laughs> these lower frequencies. So it's I just feel it's just so, such a special blessing to get there they had they create such a powerful bridge between the lower and the higher vibrations um, I just felt like I had to make that note that being said I'm going to share with you and I'll have this available as well um, invocation that I created here working with Master El Moria beloved Master El Moria and Archangel Michael please come to me now Clear me of all darkness so that I may once again reclaim my light and rejoice in my life. Please weave into all the layers of my being the purest, the highest, most profound protective frequencies available so that I may fulfill my mission on this planet with grace and ease. Shield me so that no darkness can enter my energy field or squash my light. Let only good come to me now. From this moment forward, I am a divinely protected magnet for miracles a divinely protected magnet for miracles. And I now send love and holy light to all the energies or entities that might seek to harm me so they may transcend the darkness as well. 
And when you're doing this on your own, you can also take a moment just to visualize that, feel it, and you can repeat this three times. You can even repeat it in um, three, six, nine, series of three. And now we're going to settle in to receive this powerful, protective attunement from beloved Master Almoria. So you can lay down or you can sit. I just ask that you just place awareness on your spine so that you can keep it straight. All the chakras The major chakras are aligned on the spine and energy will be able to move through them more easily with the spine straight. And just take a few nice, slow, deep breaths with me now. Breath is the essence of the divine. You're clearing the air. You're clearing the mind as you breathe. This is signaling to all levels of your being. It's out with the old and in with the new. Out with the old, in with the new. Out with the dark and in with the light. We ask beloved Archangel Michael and Archangel Metatron to guard and lead this holy attunement to the highest protective energies and frequencies available to us. Archangel Michael places his blue flame sword into the top of our heads going down the spine down the legs down out through the bottoms of the feet and out through the base of the spine and expanding within and all around us Archangel Michael's energy within and all around us Shielding us completely and totally from any darkness, anything that doesn't serve us. But helping us to be completely and totally open to all the good that we are about to receive. And it is from this space that we call on you, beloved Master Almoria, Master of the blue flame of the will of God. We call on you for your powerful cleansing and protective abilities. It is our intention to clear ourselves from any darkness that has connected to us. We ask that the darkness be replaced by the highest, purest frequencies and that we receive at this moment the perfect protection for our energy body, however that is, if it's a certain element, a color, a symbol, whatever that vibration is, that it be come one with us now, so that everywhere that we go, we are safe, we are guarded, we are shielded from the dark, and we are open to the light. We are always open to the good, 
but completely and totally protected, safe for us to move forward in our lives missions. Safe. Because our essence is always sustained by this new found energy protection, this energetic upgrade that we are receiving today. And it is from this space that we find ourselves in a lapis crystal pyramid with Archangel Michael, Master El Moria, Archangel Metatron, and our spirit guides. I even see some totem animals with us now. Our higher self, our highest essence. We enter into the center of the pyramid. There is the most beautiful fire pit with a blue flame extending all the way to the outside of the pyramid and to the heavens. There's the purest white sand at the bottom of the fire pit. It's there to ground you as you enter the blue flame Enter the blue flame and allow all the darkness within your root chakra to cleanse completely and totally. All the fears about your safety, your security, having your needs met, any dark energies or entities that have attached to your root purified in the blue flame. You are now empowered with the highest essence, your divine essence, that wisdom, that knowledge filling the root chakra, you are profoundly safe and secure. And your unique essence of protection begins to fill the root chakra and the trunk of your body, all of the organ systems, the lower body in the bones, this protective energy becoming one with your root chakra now, becoming one with you, it's a new way of being, safe, secure, strong, vital, prosperous, abundant you. Master El Moria placing his hand on the front and the back of your root chakra just to seal this energy. Beloved Master El Moria, thank you for accepting this heart link invitation and merging your energy with ours. For fully clearing and protecting us in our root chakra. Thank you. We thank you. And the blue flame penetrating the sacral chakra now. Penetrating, oh, clearing out any energy that's not ours. 
clearing out other people's emotional baggage cleansing out our own emotional baggage our own negativity cleansing away any rigidity within our system so that we can flow with life the blue flame empowers us with the purest frequencies releasing us completely and totally of any negative entities or energies that have attached to our sacral chakra whether it's through the connection to a loved one or someone in our lives or a connection to our own fears we release this now to the holy blue flame we are blessed we are empowered now with our highest frequencies our high selves we are tuned to the frequency of joy of bliss releasing all the negative patterns with addictions addictions leave us so vulnerable to negative entities and energies we release these all now and we fully embrace our highest essence joy pleasure passion creativity flexibility flow healthy relationships healthy connections balanced connections justice in all our encounters with others master al moria places his hands on the front and the back of our sacral sealing in these new energies and weaving in our protective shield into the sacral protecting us completely and totally in all of the organ systems in the sacral the sexual organs the lower back the the fluids in our body all receiving the blessings of protection and empowerment that are unique to our needs and that may even be different within our chakra system different for each of the chakras and i'm noticing that even in the different chakras we may receive extra again shields of protection they may come in forms of symbol of crystals of elements of colors and then an overall theme for our entire being there is a special shield that's being placed within each of our relationships now so that we're only uplifted by our current relationships extra layer of protection so that we can receive the love but have nice beautiful clear boundaries and we move up now the blue flame penetrating our solar plexus Master El Moria, thank you for merging your energy with ours. Merging with all of our entire beings, each of our chakras. The root, the sacral, the solar plexus now releasing any darkness, any dark entities or energies that have connected to us through our solar plexus we release any fears of being powerless any fears that lead us to being manipulative 
we release any fears that lead us to be meek and meager and not ask for what we need. We release any negativity that leads to feelings of worthlessness, any issues with self-confidence, any issues that we have with battling low energy or fatigue that bar us from taking that positive action, taking those positive action steps. from living in our purpose, anything that blocks us in any way from being and embodying our purest divine power. It is safe for us to take our power back as we fully release this darkness. And now we allow the blue flame energy to imprint our pure divine essence of our personal power, our divine power aligning our will with the divine will, that highest essence of ourself, empowering us with physical vitality and the energy that we need to move forward in our lives. And empowering us so that we completely and totally believe in ourselves, believe we see who we are. We have the greatest confidence in ourselves, in our worth. And Master El Moria now places his hand on the front and the back of our solar plexus, sealing in these purest, highest frequencies and now imprinting us with the perfect protection within the solar plexus, within the associated organ systems, the stomach, the kidneys, the upper digestive system. The adrenals. Feel, sense this extra layer of protection woven in to your entire being and particularly your solar plexus and that whole area now. The middle back. Some of us are receiving extra protection in the back now. An extra shield. And now we move upward the blue flame penetrating the heart center now releasing any negative entities or energies that connected us through this holy sacred center we release all the pain from our hearts now all the anger any lack of forgiveness within us releasing any grief any lack of love that we hold for ourselves or others purified in the blue flame now oh, and we release all the darkness now and we receive the empowerment of our highest essence, of our purest love. We're being imprinted with love, compassion, understanding, kindness, generosity, gratitude. Pure love, pure love for ourselves, pure love for the entire planet, pure love for the entire collective, for the universe. 
imprinted into our being completely and totally now. And Master El Moria places his hand on the front and the back of our heart center. Thank you, Master El Moria, for completely merging your energy with ours and blessing us with the most profound, protective energies and frequencies within and all around our heart center and all of the associated organ systems, the heart and the lungs and our immune system. Oh, receiving the most powerful protection and sealing in all those pure energies that we received. And many of us, many of us are receiving a shield on the back heart center. This is a place where we get attached with the energies of guilt. So we're receiving extra protection there now. Beautiful. Thank you, beloved Master El Moria. Thank you. And now we move upward to the throat center. The blue flame penetrating and purifying our center for expression. We're releasing any negative entities or energies that have blocked and connected to us through our throat chakra. We release any fears of expressing our beauty both personally and professionally. We release any blocks to leaving the most beautiful legacy behind on this planet from expressing with beauty and eloquence. We release any harsh words or harsh patterns within our language. We release it into the blue flame now. We release any words that we use that are not a vibrational match for that which we want to create. And now we receive the purest blessings of our essence, of our highest self and the blue flame. We now speak with great truth and love. We speak with the voice of the angels, the voice of our highest selves. We speak with the wisdom of our highest selves. We have eloquence of word, beauty in word in the words that we use in our mind, in our self-speech, and the outer word. And we fearlessly express our skills, express our beauty in the world. And we are now ready to receive the protective blessing and empowerment of beloved Master El Moria as he places a hand at the back of our neck and a hand at the front of our throat sealing in all the beautiful energies that we have received as well as a beautiful protective essence and shield, a protective grid within and all around our throat, our neck, our lymphatic system. in all the organs in our throat receiving this blessing and now we move well, there is an extra shield of protection for a lot of us in the front actually and the back of our neck we thank you Master El Moria we thank you for completely and totally protecting us, and especially those of us who are channeling the words of spirit. We're gaining extra protection here, so we only channel the words of truth and of love. We thank you, Master El Moria. We thank you. And we move upward now to the third eye in the blue flame. 
engulfs the third eye and our mind. We receive powerful cleansing here, releasing anything that blocks us from seeing our truth, anything that blocks us from connecting with spirit through our vision, anything that blocks us from gaining powerful and empowering information from our dreams, anything that blocks our clairvoyance or clairaudience. Cleanse now. Letting any negative entities or energies that have connected to our third eyes be completely and totally released now into the pure blue flame. And now we are open to receiving the blessing empowerment from beloved Master El Moria. He places one hand at the forehead, one hand at the back of our head, sealing in the beautiful energies that we received and sealing and weaving in our protective shield for our third eye and our entire being our entire essence. We see the truth. We see clearly our clairvoyance, our clairaudience profoundly amplified. Our minds are clear and balanced. We connect with ourselves, our spirit selves, our guides, the angels and the masters, and the creator of all that is through our dreams. And astral travel comes to us with great ease. Feel this protection woven in. It's just part of you now. It's part of who you are. You are protected from the dark visions that once haunted you. You are protected on a whole new level. Now moving up to the crown, the blue flame penetrates our crown chakra and all of the organ systems associated the brain the pineal, the pituitary glands as they're connected to the third eye and the crown being cleansed, cleansed completely and totally. Release anything that blocks you from connecting to the divine. Anything that blocks you from connecting to the infinite expanse of wisdom that is always available to you. Release anything that clouds your mind. Releasing any mental dis-ease. Releasing any mental patterns of negativity. Releasing all the darkness that blocks your clear cognizance, blocks that inner knowing. All released in the blue flame. Any negative energies or entities that have connected through the crown, connected through the opening of the crown in any way, cleansed, purified in that blue flame. And now, We are open to receiving the blessing, the empowerment of the blue flame of our highest essence and of Master El Moria. Thank you for merging your energy with ours. Master El Moria, thank you. 
for aligning us now with our clear cognizance, our inner knowing. We just know when it's right. It's easy for us to make decisions. We know what's good for us. We know what the truth is. We know what our truth is. We are deeply, profoundly connected to the divine and divinely guided in all that we do. We are flooded with divine inspirations. We do such magnificent work on this earth. We are fully in tune with our mission and live our mission every day in every way. And it is from this space Master El Moria places both of his hands at the top of our head. Oh blessing us with the most powerful protective shield on our crown and within our mind and all the organ systems of the brain. Wow, powerful protection happening for us in the crown. An extra protection for us during our states of meditation, of divination, of all spiritual work for healing, for channeling, extra protection happening now. Powerful shield placed at the crown. We're always able, all of these protective shields and protective energies They only protect us from the darkness. We are completely and totally open to all the good offered to us at all times and in every moment. We thank you, Master El Moria. We thank you for completely and totally Grounding these energies for us, shielding us completely and totally. Now the shield, he's completing the shield within and all around us, our auric field. He's cleansed us so meticulously, protected us so meticulously. At this moment in time, there is nowhere darkness can enter. We are completely and totally protected and shielded, and we've been purified to our highest light. Master El Moria, thank you for fully and completely merging your beautiful, cleansing, and protective energies with ours. We know that moving forward now, We are highly protected in a unique way that suits our needs with greatest perfection. We're also aware that we are receiving profound blessings and will be able to work with our own energies to cleanse and protect ourselves in a more effective way. Thank you for shielding us and sealing these energies in completely and totally, inner and outer chakras, cleansed and protected. All of our organ systems, cleansed and protected. The Helix Healing Collective, weaving these energies in, using their spirals, flat spiral rainbow energies, down through the top of our heads, down through our entire bodies and out through the bottoms of our feet, bringing all the chakras into perfect balance, pulling any excess energy out through the bottoms of our feet as a gift to the earth. We are now in perfect harmony, completely cleared and protected. Thank you, Master El Moria. Thank you. Thank you, Archangel Michael, Metatron, our spirit guides, all the angels, all the ascended masters, the creator of all that is, for creating this perfect attunement and alignment for us.